if you speak to the top management team, we're still hungry to develop the company to new levels. And we want to be a 100 million user company. Now we have 20 million living in Kazakhstan, the population of the country, around 15 million use our product. We love every single consumer that we have and the merchant that is providing the services to our consumers through our platforms. But again, we are just hungry for bigger. We believe there is something that we can export from the country. People think about Kazakhstan as oil country, but we believe that Kaspi can now position Kazakhstan on the map of the innovations we've been successfully doing, but just going to other markets. So we definitely think about other markets. Now, the strategy for us would be quite straightforward. We're going through the process now, actually for almost a year, more time dedicated to it. We, we look at the markets, we see which markets fit the profile in terms of things like mobile penetration or cashless transactions, e-commerce, uh, obviously. And the idea is that we would like to go in the markets which are bigger than Kazakhstan. Some of the markets we think about are Eastern Europe is attractive, Asian markets are attractive, Uzbekistan, which is the big market, which has a border with Kazakhstan, also attractive. But again, we never had access to cheap financing. We're extremely focused just because we never had the luxury of having access to financial and human resources. That's we have almost not grown in number of people for the last three years or since the yeah. London IPO. So we're always extremely efficient. And from that perspective, we want to make sure that we get the country right and acquisition target right. But we will be looking at banking, fintech, payments, e-commerce. Those are the areas of our interest. But eventually, we will be looking to replicate the super app business model.